Flu can make you feel rubbish, but for some people it can be deadly. It kills up to 650,000 people a year around the world. There is a vaccine against it, but how good is it at actually protecting us against the virus? And before we can answer that, we need to take a look at how it's made. The flu jab itself is updated regularly as the virus mutates, and it's a massive piece of global detective work to track the latest strains. Scientists from almost 150 countries around the world monitor the virus all year round to see how it's changing, looking at samples taken from people with flu-like symptoms. Then, twice a year, experts meet to decide what goes into the vaccine, first for the whole of the Northern Hemisphere and then for the whole of the Southern Hemisphere in time for its winter. They have to leave enough time for hundreds of millions of doses of the vaccine to be made. The hope is that new mutations of the virus don't emerge too quickly. If that happens, the vaccine will be less effective and more people will catch the flu. So how effective have the scientists been in defeating the virus? Well, typically the jab protects between 30 and 60% of vaccinated people. Sometimes in a bad year though, it can be less effective and more people are infected and will get ill. But even if the vaccine doesn't fully protect against one strain in circulation, it'll probably protect you against the others. And people who catch flu having had the vaccine are usually less sick for shorter periods of time. So it's still really important you have the jab if you're advised to. And by the way, the flu vaccine can't give you the flu. The virus is deactivated or killed before being used. The science behind predicting how the virus evolves is getting ever more sophisticated. And although it's unlikely that flu will be eradicated anytime soon, a more effective vaccine, based on predictions of how the virus will evolve in the future, is looking like it might be in reach.